Hi everyone, I'm Noel Weeks. Welcome to my channel. And today we're going to be building my guitar pedal board. And we're going to assemble it right on here. And the first thing we need to do is add this sticky, sticky stuff onto it so that the pedals can stick. And we're going to use the Voodoo Lab Power to power it. Now the first pedal in the lineup is a wah wah. Get that classic Jimi Hendrix wah wah as its name sound. And that usually goes at the front of the board to uh, create the best effect. And next, everyone needs a tuner. And this also doubles as a kill switch. So if in a live setting, it gets too noisy or if you need a break from the hum of the guitar, you can just press this anytime to turn everything off. And then you can tune the instruments as well. Next is a very awesome section of pedals, which are called compressors. And they, as the name suggests, compress the sound to make it more thicker and even from the guitar. And here's one of my compressors. It's a nice cheap $45 one by Donner. And it does the job well. I'm definitely gonna put it on the board. But I also have a second one called the Hypergravity, which definitely has a bit more uh, bells and whistles. And I'm also gonna include it just cause I can. Next up is Distortion. And I have, I believe, the very first pedal I ever had as a teenager trying to get that Nirvana grunge sound. But it's a bit much for these days, so I think I'm gonna go with the blues driver a classic fuzz tone that uh, is all most people need in terms of distortion also we have here the Strymon flint and this is a double tremolo and reverb pedal so it definitely has a lot of sounds in one pedal which i find is great it's great for a live setting it's great with an acoustic guitar as well I once played a whole show pretty much with only this as my effects for my acoustic guitar and it um, turned out great. Also I rarely use but still essential effect is a delay and sometimes it can get that crazy sound going on but once you figure out the right way to uh, adjust it you get the sound you want for any particular sound. And finally, another exotic one is called the Lester G. We're going to hear how that sounds later. Now, let's see how they all sound together. Hey, and as you can see, some time has passed since I did the first half of the video with my haircut and all, but we're going to continue right here and test out these pedals. So. sound with no effects. We're going to start with the wah wah. And next we're going to try a compressor. try two compressors on at the same time. Bit of a fuller sound it makes. And next we can add some uh, distortion to the mix. Let's 
So we're gonna cut that down a bit and try the reverb and tremolo effect together. <laughs> Lastly, we'll try the most interesting pedal, the Lester G, which is also made for pianos as well. Let's try them all now. And that's all the pedals on my pedal board for now. Thanks for watching. See you next time.